Hey guys, we are here for the last movement using the lapel from the side control. I'm gonna isolate the arm like all the only ones before. I'm gonna block the hips using my knee. I'm gonna pull the guy and keep the pressure here. If I need, I apply my pr more pressure. If I don't, I just rest here. Now I open the lapel. And now he has this hand trying to push me or even sometimes he knows the choke is coming. He puts the hand on his choke to block here. That's fine. I'm going to go over here and going to grab the same way. I have the option to do the choke that I did before, just spinning to north south, or I have the option to switch to a wrist lock. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna come here, put a little pressure, and I'm gonna switch the here, the hand over. When I switch the hand over, he wanna push my shoulder, okay? When I, he's pushing my shoulder, all I need to do is to come here with my chin, right when on his wrist, and I lock my chin down. Really important detail, to lock the chin down, okay? Now I'm gonna come here, I'm gonna keep my elbow putting pressure on his toe, I'm going to come with both hands. I'm going to open his arm here. I grab both hands on his elbow. And all I need to do is to move my shoulder forward, keeping that pressure with the chin here. So I move my shoulder forward. And I tap him in a wrist lock control. So one more time. I use the lapel. And he strap it there. I can still choke him here. But I'm going to switch to a, to a wrist lock. So I pass over. When I pass over, he don't want to keep his hand there because the hand is going to be trapped. He want to start to push me or sometimes even push my face from here. It's okay. I'm just going to push his arm down and lock his wrist using my shin here. Really tight pressure. Like you want to force as much as you can to keep that hand close to you. Now both hands come on the elbow to be a stronger grip. I'm gonna open the elbow and I'm gonna use my shoulder going forward and my weight coming forward as well. If you need, you can even go to your toes to apply more pressure and finish on the wrist lock. So one more time here, chin comes down, stay tight, open the arm, shoulder goes forward, keep a standing hand here and finish the wrist lock. Hope you guys like it. Thank you so much.